Hey everyone, in this video we're going to take an in-depth look at the Cox TG1682 Panoramic Wi-Fi Gateway User Manual. In your kit. Power cord. Coax cable. Panoramic Wi-Fi Gateway. Ethernet cable. Front and back view. The Iris TG1682 is a DOCSIS 3.0 device offering 24 by 8 channel bonding. After the gateway is successfully connected to the network, the power, receive, send, and online indicators continuously indicate that the gateway is online and fully operational. The Cox CGM4141 Panoramic Wi-Fi Gateway for Fiber has a reset button for restoring factory settings and a USB port for future use with external devices. TEL1 TEL2 ports for connecting phones or fax machines, 4 Ethernet ports for wired internet access a cable port for connection to the cable wall outlet. A MO CA light indicates its use for TV services and a power port for connecting the router to its power adapter. What you'll need. Smartphone, tablet, or computer. Plug in the gateway. Connect the coax cable 1 to the gateway and an active cable outlet. Then connect the power cord 2 to the gateway and an electrical outlet. Make sure the electrical outlet isn't connected to a dimmer. Tip, plug the coax cable into a centrally located cable outlet or use the same outlet where the old device was connected. Connect to the network. Wait about 10 minutes for the gateway to power on. Then open the Wi-Fi settings on your smartphone, tablet, or computer. Connect to the network using one of the two network names SSID and the pre-shared key which is the password from the bottom label on the gateway. Once it's connected to the network, open a browser and surf the web to verify that your internet is good to go. Personalize Wi-Fi experience. We recommend you download the Cox Panoramic Wi-Fi app. The app will help you personalize your network and optimize your Wi-Fi experience. Tips. <music> Customer support. Troubleshootings Warnings. For more updates subscribe to our channel.